Good afternoon. It's Wednesday, February 16, 2011. I'm Rosie Marino with your Erner Barry Market Report, sponsored by Erner Barry's Night at the Races 2011, taking place at the Meadowlands Friday, February 25th. Now, with an update on the markets, here are Erner Barry's Market Reporters. An anomaly not usually seen within the beef market has developed, and that is the Choice Select spread has reversed, with Select Rating Beef as a composite currently valued higher than Choice Product. The last time the spread between Choice and Select cutouts favored to Select Product was in the late winter and early spring of 2009, between February 23rd and April 14th. During that period, there were eight trading days noted with the upside down value seen. What has pushed the spread to invert currently? A key factor would be the Choice Grading Percentage the amount of market-ready cattle that grade as choice quality beef, with the last USDA report showing that choice grading cattle represent 65.11% of the animals entering the slaughter mix. That leaves 26.5% grading as select in the balance spread between prime and no-roll product. Demand for beef currently remains somewhat sluggish, especially for the choice product which typically is priced above the select beef. With the economy remaining somewhat depressed, Consumers have looked to buy the lesser-priced beef at their meat display, and at this time, that just may be the higher-grading cu choice cut of beef. The ham market is said to be looking strong again today after yesterday's rise in price. Belly supplies remain limited, and trimmings are called mostly steady, though 72% trim supplies could be beginning to open up. As for the retail market, loins appear to be on an uptrend as earlier discounting has renewed interest. Butts continue to be firm due to support from the Korean market, and spare ribs are under pressure. Industry participants have been expressing bewilderment at the perplexing variety of conditions being exhibited in the turkey market right now. For some quoted lines where one player can't even get a bid, others are routinely asking and receiving full market values. Where another may be willing to entertain discounting on white meats, the next one is well cleared and can't even make an offer. The latest cold storage estimate rests at just over 292 million pounds. That's about 13 million pounds up from last week. Finally, our chart reviews the stance of turkey white meat. So far this year, white meat has been an interesting watch. Not only did it enter the year at record high levels, but it's been able to sustain that position. Recently, however, it has responded to seasonal pressure. That is all but breast trim. Uh, with consumers stretching their food budget as far as they can, Cooked turkey utilizing breast trim is proving a popular alternative to whole muscle products. That, in turn, is providing the price support depicted in our chart. Okay, good afternoon. Um, just a couple comments on the egg market. The cart market continues uh, pretty much unchanged this week so far. Retail demand uh, a little bit slower than we noticed uh, last week, but there are some increased feature activities reported uh, that should uh, get underway next week. So. Uh, uh, you know, looking forward to some of the producers certainly looking forward to that. Uh, the market's generally steady on the large. We are seeing some uh, increased availability on extra large and particularly jumbos. Uh, over to the egg product side of the markets, uh, breaking stock is, uh, is firming. Uh, a little bit improved demand there. Liquid whole egg uh, and liquid whites are both firming. Uh, much better demand there than we noticed last week. Uh, the buyer inquiry over on the frozen uh, markets and the uh, dried markets are increased. I think buyers uh, uh, certainly are, are aware of the uh, super strong corn market and looking to cover some of their needs uh, for it as far as they can at this point in time. So that pretty much does it for the uh, egg and egg product side and uh, we'll get back with you tomorrow. That's your Erner Barry Market Report brought to you by Erner Barry's Night at the Races 2011 at the Meadowlands Friday, February 25th. Please call 800-932-0617 with any questions or to order your tickets.